after the two parts which I have already explained. At the left of Our Lady, and a little above, we saw an angel, with a flaming sword in his left hand, flashing. It gave out flames that looked as though they would set the world on fire. But they died out in contact with the splendor that Our Lady radiated towards him from her right hand. Penance! 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 Do not tell this to anybody. Francisco, yes, you may tell him. And when you pray the rosary, say after each mystery, 
O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of your mercy. Is there anything more you want of me? No. I do not want anything more of you today. What did she look like? What did she say? In Portugal, the dogma of the faith will always be preserved. In many nations, perhaps in almost the entire world, the faith will be lost. The pastors of the church will fail gravely in the duties of their office. Through their fault, consecrated souls and the faithful in great numbers will let themselves be seduced by pernicious errors spread everywhere. This will be the time of the decisive battle between the Blessed Virgin and the Devil. A wave of diabolical disorientation will be hurled over the world. Satan will introduce himself, even to the highest summit of the Church. He will blind the minds and harden the hearts of pastors. And God will deliver them to themselves as a chastisement for their refusal to obey the requests of the Immaculate Heart of Mary. <laughs>